vibrant surroundings such as its breathtaking beaches and stunning temples. It is a place where the local people welcome you and makes you feel just like at home. No wonder why some people call Thailand the land of smiles. We flew into Bangkok, worked our way towards the city and just took it in. The hot weather hit us like a train and the smell of all types of street food really set us off. Yo, what's good people? We're back again with a new vlog. Today we're in Thailand. Bangkok, never been here before. We're gonna stay here for two days before we're gonna head south to do something a little bit more exotic. You ready, Jim? Because I'm absolutely pumped for this. I'm ready. Woohoo! What is this? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. One, two, three. <laughs> Yo, what's good people? Good morning. 4.36 a.m. Uh, yeah, we got two hours of sleep. Absolutely tired, but we're heading south. <laughs> I'm excited. Super excited. Jim's in the toilet. Just ordered a taxi. Let's do it. <laughs> Room cleaning! Check out please. Airport. Suvarnabhum. No, uh, DMK we got. No one for you and one for me. I'm excited. I'm probably gonna get hurt, but it doesn't really matter. It's great Thailand. We're gonna have a great time, right, Jim? Let's go. It's gonna be great. Some type of island, at least. So good. Yeah. After a few days of missing the sunrise, I was finally able to get my ass up to experience the beautiful sunrise Thailand has to offer. And I'ma be honest, it was so worth it because sleep is something you can catch up on when you're being lazy back home, not while traveling, you know. Just woke up for sunrise, the sun's not up yet. I think it's gonna come though behind the clouds. I have no idea though. I'm gonna try to get a little time lapse, see how it works, but I think I'm gonna figure science out, you know. I woke up way before Jim did, I was really curious to find out what he was doing back at the hotel once I got back. It turned out that he was having the chillest time of his life, and you already know that I had to ruin that. Uh, we can't start it, 
so these this tight people are gonna try to fix it. So Jim is on my scooter right now, he's driving so I can film. All right, a few minutes later, we're at this workshop. I think the battery is gone, or maybe we need oil, I don't know. All right, so we had to charge the battery of the moped. Uh, apparently it was empty. We gotta wait here for 30 minutes. It's a bunch of chicken here. It's like they got a farm right by the workshop. And there's pigs here. What's up, pig? Yeah, Jim, it's done, right? Finally, let's go. This guy did a good job. <laughs> Yo, Jimmy, where are we going? We're going to Kasamui. <laughs> Kasamui, yeah. yeah. That's right. On our way to the ferry, yo. Bumpy roads. Got us a taxi. Jim's gonna get sunburned, so he needs some sunscreen. <laughs> Yo Jim, what's up? Where are we? We are at... Yo Jim, what's up? Where are we? We're currently at the waterfall. I don't know. <laughs> Yo Jim, where are we? We're currently at the waterfall park, I don't know, in the middle of the jungle and... Zanian. <laughs> Yo Jim, where are we at? <laughs> Yo Jim, what's up? Where are we now? Currently at the waterfall park. Waterfall the park? <laughs> <laughs> Standing on this pretty random beach, actually. It's beautiful here, the sun is setting. Yeah, it's amazing. Yo, we're currently sitting here at this restaurant. We haven't eaten all day. I'm absolutely starving now. Let's get Yo, some food. Oh, I got some food. But how the hell is that gonna fill up my belly? Yo, we just ate some food. I wouldn't say a lot of food because it wasn't a lot. It saved my belly a little bit. I still need more. We just ordered, what did we order? Uh, oh, Something so beautiful so. Thai food, I don't know. Mm. What's your name, sir? Yeah, what do you want? Yeah, <laughs> your name's yeah? Yeah. Okay, so it's getting a bit late. We're going into 7 Eleven. We need some snacks to bring to the hotel room. Hello? <laughs> what is up, people? Just woke up. Nah, no, Jim just woke up. I've been awake for a little while. Uh, we're riding our scooters up this really steep hill, and we got this beautiful view. This view is. Amazing. It's insane actually. So we made it to the highest Buddha in Kosamoy at around 600 meters above sea level. It's honestly crazy. I, don't, I have no idea how they made that crazy Buddha all the way up here because the roads were insane. Sunrise! 
last mission? Let's get it. And just like that, our trip to Thailand came to an end. But don't worry, we'll be back soon. <laughs>